To all my next levelers, good morning to you. This morning during my time with God, I was reading um, this book by Dr. Miles Monroe, the late great Miles Monroe. I realized something, man, when it comes to our purpose and potential that God has put within us, like oftentimes we judge ourselves or we compare ourselves to what other people are doing and accomplishing. And the reality is they might not be living up to their full potential. And we feel like, hey, we pretty sweet with it. Or we might compare ourselves to where we are in life. When the reality is we should be comparing ourselves to what we could have accomplished. Like, did we give our best? And so, man, I'm committed today not to compare myself to anybody else, compare myself to what I did yesterday, but did I give God my best today? Did I maximize my day? Did I get everything out of today? And uh, that's what I plan on doing today. Let's get it. We came a long way. That's what the song say. And I could do all things. I could do all things. Yeah, I could do all things. Yeah, yeah. So and was he the was he the like principal of the No, he's the school counselor and he's but he's in charge of the curriculum. He found you um, just by a YouTube search who I wanna say was looking for someone else. This is the second person who said they were looking for someone else this week and came across you instead and was blown away. And his top priority is not to have me speak, it's for the curriculum. The curriculum first, no, then he, to bring you in. But if you have to decide. Yeah. Okay. Because he wants yeah. options. And right. I said, well, the speaking portion is this, and then the, this is whatever, let's talk to you. But I said, but let's just see, you know, what we can do. And I sent him a quote for you speaking alone. Mm. And he was like, I will find the money for this. He, I mean, he raved about the curriculum. So what was he, What working. was he saying? He was like, this is the best curriculum I've ever seen. Mm. And he was like, it just aligns with everything that is relevant right now. Best kept secret. Best kept, the giant is about to wake up. Mm. I felt that. Also, Jimmy's gonna be speaking um, September 22nd. This school, Riverside County Schools, they have been trying to get Jimmy for the past two years. Okay. And there was, there was virtual options available, but they were like, they didn't have the funding that they really wanted to spend. They want Jeremy in. He was like, we don't want him virtual, we want him live. We're gonna talk about, you're gonna overall talk about how you travel all over. You speak at conferences, you speak to superintendents, you speak to students all over the country, but you could do but so much. There's only but so much Jeremy that can go around. So you, you can't be at every school, but your curriculum can. Mm -hmm. Next level students. Okay, next level students. Yes, sir. Yep. Yeah. All right, good. Let's run that. Hey, what's up, y'all? Check this out. I hope y'all enjoyed today's video. Now, check this out. I've got so many more videos to check out, and I have schools reaching out every single day wanting me to come to the school to speak. I wish I could be there. I wish I could go to every school and speak, but it's not possible. Even though I can't be there, our curriculum came. That's right. Our Next Level Students curriculum takes the message, it's the heart, everything I've been sharing paired with social emotional learning and PBIS. Like, it's amazing. It's Next Level. That is something you should strongly consider to share with your students. So check out the website, nextlevelstudents.org, and we're excited to help you take your school to the next level. Here's what we're doing now. A couple calls, a couple meetings. It's been nonstop all day, um, but now we're heading up to Phipps Plaza. It's a, it's a pretty dope mall right across from Linux Mall here in Atlanta. Get fitted for my outfit for tonight. Shout out to Mr. Two Weeks Out. You know what I said, Jason Lobdell. Uh, shout out to Mrs. Two Weeks Out, Helani. You know, they had their 20 year wedding anniversary. So, all the stars coming out, all the influencers, the who's who in Atlanta. It's going to be special tonight. So, um, Tracy's got her dress. It's fitting her right. we stepping out tonight. Stay tuned. Hey, this pair is fire, too. All right. Boom, 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 boom. Just like that. What's up, fam? How you feeling, man? Good, how are you? Man, amazing, right, bro. Good to see you. Yes, sir, likewise. Right. You ready? Yeah. This is a joint I almost got um, for another event. Was about to buy it. Was like, I'm gonna kill him. And Dave Shands came in, what up, Jay? I'm like, what up, boy? He's like, yeah, just he picked up my suit. He's like, I got this joint right here. I'm like, I looked at him like, come on, man. You know what I'm saying? Like, but they, nobody knew. Yeah. 
So you switched jackets? Yeah, the other one, the other one just wasn't, the other one wasn't just quite hitting. The bow tie in there too? Uh-oh, the extra soft? I don't know. Let's see. Let's see. I'm gonna be open. Oh, 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 oh okay. What that is? Oh yeah, no, oh yeah. I'm not really at now. My partner Nordy Hugh, shout out, hey, shout out to Nordy Hugh, play cousin for life. Nordy Hugh, man, he first put me on the Ascot boy. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Back in the day. Give me right. Yeah. Yeah. Oh yeah. You know what I'm saying? Arms fit right. Yo, yo, what's up, bro? Hey, so check this out, man. Um, the video was done, and the flyer is, um, not the video, the flyer is done, and the website is done. So let me know when you want to jump on the phone so we can talk about the, uh, the game plan. Okay. All right, so I got to go do the thing real quick, okay, buddy? I'll try. Can't make any promises. Man, today was a good day. If anything, man, I would probably have to think about, speak about the importance of relationships. I'm really big on that, you know, when it comes to, I'm looking at all the different speaking engagements we're getting, um, the opportunities with the curriculum. Um, I think about the people in our company, our team. We got 19 team members the relationships we have with them, the relationships that they're building on behalf of the company, the brand, and really investing in those relationships. You know, I think about my family, uh, my children, you know, they need the best from me. Uh, also with our Speakers Academy, you know, I was on a call earlier and the people that's in our Next Level Speakers Elite program, I'm setting them up with a program, I'm putting them on with some of our services and they're gonna make thousands of dollars. And this is all because we're in relationship. Like I really do want people to win. And uh, tonight, man, me and Tracy are heading out to uh, Jason and Helani's 20th celebration. Uh, can I go? Can I go no, to... you can't go, buddy. <laughs> uh, but even that, it's all about relationships. They support us, we support them. And so, man, what a great time to be alive and really foster the relationships that we've been blessed to have. So, yeah, speaking of relationships, buddy, let's play for a little bit and I gotta get dressed and shower and get up out of here, okay? Night was amazing you know what I'm saying I typically wear a t-shirt and jeans and hoodies every day so it felt good to get dressed and step out with my wife and celebrate you know what I'm saying Jason and Helani I don't want you to miss what took place tonight we didn't just celebrate their union we didn't just celebrate 20 years of marriage no 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 we celebrated 20 years of the struggle we celebrated 20 years of service 20 years of sacrifice 20 years of them working on their marriage while they're building up their kids and staying together and fight through the rough times while they build up different dynasties and joint collaborations. Like we celebrated their love for one another and resiliency. Me and Tracy have been married for 12 years. Marriage is not easy, but it'll work if you work it. So the question I have for you, right, before I let y'all go, because I'm about to get some rest because I'm tired because I'm still gonna wake up at four o'clock in the morning. The question I have for you is, and the question I have for me, are we living the type of lives worthy of celebrating? 
You feel me? People's birthdays come around, they want to turn up for their birthday. But did you accomplish what you said to accomplish this year? Did you meet your goals? That's next level living, y'all. I'm all for celebrating life. But what exactly are we celebrating? The struggle? Let's make sure we work in every single day to live the type of lives worthy of celebrating. One day, we'll be celebrating you. Let's get it.